Hello everyone! Today we're going to uh, do another laptop screen repair. Today we're looking at the Sony VAIO SVE 17 something. Um, I've turned the laptop off and now the next thing that we're going to want to do is remove the battery. This one right here. Ah, uh, <laughs> it off. Okay, so we remove the battery. So now we're going to open it up and remove the bezel from the screen. That's this part around here. Mm -hmm. There's uh, two visible screws, one here, one here. And there's two screws behind the main, uh, behind the computer, one here and one here. Those are going to be a little hard to remove, but we'll manage. So there are cross-headed screws, so we're going to use a cross-headed Phillips screwdriver. So that's all the screws. Now we're going to want to remove the bezel. Now be careful about this because this sometimes turns out to be a little bit of a hassle. It's pretty fragile too. You just want to hear the clicks when you're removing the plastic. Don't pull too hard, but pull hard enough. Don't be scared to put some force on it. Part two, and that's that. And now we can slowly remove the bezel from the hinges. We can put that to the side. Now we've got the screen here, and now we want to remove the screws that are holding it in. So moving on, we've got uh, three screws over here and three screws over here. Uh, we're going to start by removing the top ones. So we'll move one over here. Again, these are uh, cross-headed screws. One gone. Now over here. And now we proceed by removing all the other screws. So that's six screws in total. Now on this side. All right, all the screws have been removed. Okay, so now, now all the screws have been removed. Now we want to slowly fold out the screen, but be careful, there is a cable at the back and it's most likely uh, taped to the screen. So you want to go slowly and uh, remove the cable from the back of the screen. Just, you know, push it loose all the way to the bottom. And so now that that's happened, uh, you can see that the screen is encased in a frame. It goes around the screen like this, here and here. Now in the side of the screen there are one, two, three screws here and three screws here. We want to screw those out because those are holding the screen in place. Be careful because the screen might shift a bit. We're going to move to the other side now so it doesn't uh, hang loose on one side only. Mm 
one screw left. That's that. So now the screen is loose from the frame, but you still want to remove the cable over here. I'm going to move the camera a little bit. Right there is a cable that is holding the screen. It's connecting the screen to the computer. So what you want to do first is remove this piece of tape with a sharp knife. Just, you know, get it loose and then pull the rest off with your hand. Slowly, so you don't damage the cable. And now you just, it is wedged in the stab over here. You can uh, do it with a, uh, what do you so is? Yeah, so is it. Just with some precise object, you can uh, loosen the cable from the slot. Just make sure you do it slowly. So as to not damage any of the connectors, just you know, push it out from the sides, side by side. It's right. One more over here, and it's out. Okay, so that's that. You can now pull it loose and remove the old screen. That's the old one. You put that to the side. And here we have the brand new screen from LaptopScreens.com. Remove the protective film that's over it. Now we put it in place again. First of all, we're going to put it over here so we can reconnect the cable. And uh, so what we're going to do is just reapply it the way it was applied before. Got the any zoomed? So just very slowly grab the tab, the, the sticky tab, and just move it into the slot. When you have it, you just pull on the tab a little bit until you feel, you don't feel a click, but you feel it slotting into place. When that has happened, you just reapply the tape on the new screen. Now we're going to screw it back into the frame. So uh, after you've applied the new cable, you want to uh, reattach the frame to the new screen. Uh, this might prove a bit tricky because the frame doesn't always want to stay in the same place. So either you have to have a professional workbench of sorts, which I don't have at the moment, but I do have a lovely assistant who is going to help me for a bit with keeping uh, the screen in place. So now that we've uh, reattached all those screws, we are going to uh, reattach the six screws that we've taken out down here. Okay, so now that the screws have been reattached, we can uh, put the bezel back on. Or wait, first we're going to test if the screen actually works. Okay, so we've attached the power supply for a bit to see if the machine works. We'll turn it on. And there is the screen. So we know that it works and now we can uh, reattach the bezel. So just put it into the bottom of the screen first. Just make sure that it covers all the edges. Now you just start pushing till you hear clicks everywhere to put all the plastic clamps back into place. Now down here as well. So, so we've reattached the bezel and now all that's left is to reattach the screws that were in the bezel.
and then just one left down here. And that's that, you've replaced the screen of your Sony VAIO SVA-A17. Thanks for watching and I hope it helped.